Alright, this is the impact we're having, just a handful of us. As you might see over there, there's one lorry, that lorry, this lorry, that. Let's say a little bit of direct action. Yeah, check this out, that. Barracks. This. It's getting to be a, quite a parking parking yard up here. Yeah. Let's see how many um, lorries we're getting by the end of the day. And all that. And that. Listen to that. Do you want to live next to that all day, every day? Unless, unless it's one of the lesser evils. On film, on film, yeah, on camera. Come over here and talk to Zoe. Come here. Yeah. Got, no point in having empty promises, may as well get it on look at camera. Him, look at him, he's standing over there looking all right. He won't come over. Oh, uh, is that another there? Yeah, okay. Guys, I'll need you to move out the road. Yeah, that's the well, boss. We'll Guys, I'm fine, you're on the pavement. No, we don't have to stay on the pavement, do we? We do, guys. We can walk up. This is our street as well as you can stay on. Alright, okay. Let me say this. Here's a point. If you're obstructing any vehicles, passing through the road, you're committing the offensive obstruction. What's the definition of obstruction, please, as we know? Willfully obstructing the road. Well, this is your decision, not mine, so I'm cool. Right, yeah, I'm just... I'm not... I'm not... I'm not I, guys, well, you've got a right to protest. I'm not asking you to stop your protest in any way. I'm just asking you to move over onto the pavement to allow the vehicles in and out. Now, can I also look at the side? I want you to stick around to the next hour if you do allow the vehicles in there. How many wipes are there? Do you work prepared to do that? I'm, I'm going to get some officers down here. <laughs> yeah, no shit. Unfortunately, I'm the only sergeant for the whole of Barnet, so I can't commit. Yeah, unfortunately, are. So, I'll take those in. So, you're going to let these lorries in. Unfortunately, I'm the only sergeant for I, you know, at the end of the day, we want a day off. They're not compliant. I appreciate that. But by delaying these lorries, it's only going to slow the process down, isn't it? It's going to drag the whole building They're allowed to run a generator on all night. Environmental does nothing. No one's doing anything. Well, no one is we pay our rent, we're in touch with the This is the only way we can get it. Yeah, this is hardly peaceful dwelling, I must admit. You know, enjoying the peaceful dwelling of your home. Don't be so sorry for your living. But like I said, you've got, you've had the public environment, we're waiting for the solution. I'm sorry, as far as I'm concerned, money talks. I was present when they were here. And uh, we're waiting on them to so, uh, 
pretty so far as to comment on that and show them something nice. We got told the other day that they didn't help anybody out the drawer. Well... So, we told... No, believe me, they didn't help anybody. We're, we're not stopping. We're, we're not stopping the plan from working. Honest, yeah, yeah. Just try. I just want to try and get something clarified. Like who has uh, who has right of way on this road? Is it a pedestrian or is it the lorry? Because I'm under the impression it's a pedestrian as long as you're walking or moving. Right. So you know, lorries that because you're not, lorries aren't allowed to squash you. They've got to go round you or give way for you while you're travelling across or along a road. So I just. That still feel that as long as you're moving, you should realise that you do have the right of way. The obstruction is its own, only there and then. You know, if they move it, it's not an obstruction. It's the same way as you guys are committing an obstruction now, but if you move across the pavement, you're no longer No, if we move on the road, we're not obstructing. No longer exists. Okay? What about if it takes some time? Some of these people are fairly old. If it takes them a while to cross out of the way of the lorries, would they be given the time? I mean, some of them are 86 years old. You know, and they do obviously, want to... Obviously... They might, they, they might take a little... They have as much opportunity to cross the road. Yeah. If, they must if, have an if, opportunity. If these guys are walking to and from, yeah. uh, that will be, you know, yeah. it's, it's already a static case. Yeah. Because I think, you know... So, they need a what you got, don't they? They, they need to take over. Mandate. Yeah. Yeah. But being locked up in the cell at Collendale isn't going to help your protest, is it? Uh, yeah, really, have a point, yeah. yeah. Is, is it really in the long yeah. run going to aid your situation? I don't want it to end that way. We can resolve this by moving over to the pavement. I'm going to step back in case you get some pepper spray out. <laughs> moving over to the pavement, continue your protest on there. Well, actually, they could carry it in. You're going to end up, these guys, these guys, the guys here are running up and down the road. Why so should we have to put with these guys? We're just trying to resolve that. Why should we put up with these guys running up and down the road? Well, I spoke, like I said, I spoke to some manager. He's going to relay the fact. Oh, he's the deputy. He's not a man. Okay, well, he's the most senior person said, on the yeah, site yeah. at the moment. We have gone to the council he's three gonna, times last week. Well, the council's yeah. gone to well, them. He's the guy that came out and identified himself as the person on the site. Right. Right. Well, I'm not going to get into know about whether he's the team boy or what. He is. It doesn't actually, unfortunately, it's not going to affect what's going on today. Guys, are you prepared to move across the paper to resolve this? Yeah, okay. Stand here, stand here. Okay. If we can move across now, then we can start. Yeah, yeah, nice. Either way, I'm quite happy, as long as you're not in the road and the truck's in the lorry. We will not stop the lorries going in here, but if they're parking up here, we will. We're well, unloading here. Yeah. Uh, what would satisfy me personally is for you to bring a manager out here, please. It can't be hard. Look, I can't make look, the manager come out. You can. I can't. You can. But you can make us, you you can make us do a load of things. Well, I can go and speak to him, but he, he said he's not coming out. Oh, he said he's not coming out. <laughs> <laughs> I got that. Yeah, he said he's not coming out. What a spineless tosser. Right yeah. They've had supposed to come out and speak to you guys. They've had all this. They've had a public inquiry where you've had your opportunity, and that's what, the way. And they are really pissed at the banner being up there. The point is, they're taking advantage you know, of the time they have. Oh, but guess what? The public won't allow it. No, I know. And you call that? Do you think that's fair? Do you think it's fair on the residents that live here? And the police were there and they wouldn't even do 
a thing and we can even hand in that 200,000 people. So how is that there, love? You know, I know for a fact you take notes to protect the people. Yeah. There's a lady being but armed in there. there. Up at the town hall, you were protecting corporation. Oh. Is that fair? Is that right? No, because he works for us. And another thing, why there was four officers there? Sorry, no, let me just tell you. Yeah, no, 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 let me just tell you this. Uh, why there was four officers yeah. there? Four yeah, come officers. Come across the side of the road and we can continue. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'll sit on my phone. Um, why we were there, four officers. The uh, security men took their badges off, they yeah. were told to take their security badges off, so therefore they were no longer security men. But they were still there being heavy handed up there. And your officers still didn't take this public, this public. Why didn't they let us in? Why did the police let us in? Why are they, why are they sticking up the corner Are they even told to come in? You know, you, not you personally, the police should be out Arresting paedophiles in Parliament. Yeah. That's what they should be doing. Not harassing people that are trying to save their homes and the help of their children and old people. I appreciate that. Do you understand? But, but why, are you, why aren't you getting people out of the Why? Why is a 78 million man not one of them doing it? Why is that there? And you as a policeman don't know that. You as a policeman do not know that. And you know there's people out there. There's There's enough evidence to see the proof and nothing to be done about it. So how can that be fair? You need to say that to the independent agency. Yeah, really. Oh, what? The independent RDCC? Yeah, really. Do they work? Ah, ha, ha. They don't work. Yeah. Though. No. Whose pocket are they in, though? Whose pocket are they in, though? You know it's what it's like. And I know you'd like to be moving me from the car, but I know you'd like to, because I can see it all over your face. Can we possibly move out of the way? Oh, yeah, I'm not in the road, hub. Can I? I'm sitting on my car. Are you car. happy for me to move your chair? Thanks. I'm sitting on my car and I'm No, I'm not going to stop you from sitting on your car. As long as you're not obstructing the road. Come and have a look from the bird's eye view. Yes, Dad! Come and have a look. You have my word, I will come upstairs and I'll leave my colleague here. Look down here. What camera should they get to the car? Look through. What camera should they get to the car? Look through. 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 Don't run the BBC over. Coming in for another try. No cup of tea for you. No cup of tea. I'm going to you know. be here like this, sir. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to huh? be here like this, Joe. What? I'm not on the road. Well, yeah. I'm sitting here. Yeah. I'm yeah. Oh, that's true. Yeah, yeah. We like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look, not on the road. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah.
Absolutely, yeah. Awesome. Our property, our property on their property, they can't touch our property. They've got to take us to court. Um, it's driving them nuts. Well, they can, can't they? No. Why not? No, it's, like, it's like tying something to the outside of a fence. You know, you can't, uh, you can't, you can't remove it. It's, on the, it's, it's out here, isn't it? Their property's Well, it depends inside. where the boundary is. It's, is it? He's telling me the boundary is this yellow line. Yeah, I, well, I, I know that when you put your property on someone's property, it always it's a civil matter. So um, it, it becomes immediately the jurisdiction of the courts, the uh, civil courts, and so that for them to touch your property, it's like wheel clamps. You could look at the same principle with wheel clamping. Uh, it's driven them nuts all day. Otherwise, you know, if they, if they, they how long has that been up there? Since this morning, seven o'clock. Yeah. See, the thing is, they haven't. Um, they, they know that they can't touch it. They've already come over and said, "Look, can you take it?" Uh, off? Uh, you know. So what we doing with that? Um. And there you go, that's the dilemma caused by one sign. One person put that sign up and knew it would cause maximum damage. Yeah. A, a constable for every a constable for every demonstrator. Yeah. I'm glad they didn't bring any for the vid the videographers. Should have brought blue boobs. Would have got a better reception. 